Hey, hi, how are you doing? My name is Sumner. I'm bringing you a guide today on the best weapons to be using at the start of the wipe for 12.1230. The UMP straight away is the first gun you're probably going to want to be going for as soon as possible. With this gun, it's super easy to mod and it's all through freaking dollars. If you're wanting to use it, nice and easy again with the attachments, all you've got to do is whack on a foregrip. Uh, you can either use the CAC VFG. You can also go for the RK6, RK1, uh, RK0, or the RK1 or 4. They're going to be most commonly the first grips that you're going to be using on your guns. If not, whack yourself on a Cobra. Super easy. And also add it on the uh, suppressor. This is probably the most costly part of the weapon. Uh, and again, that's all you literally need to do. Oh, sorry. Don't forget. You'll want yourself a tactile device. Mine right now is the Balder Pro. Uh, Efficient flashlight. It's got a laser on it as well. I'm pretty decent. Scope wise, you can either go iron sights. It's nice and clean. Otherwise, grab, grab yourself the EKP, whack your on the Cobra for the extra ergonomics, and you've got yourself a 38 recoil weapon. And honestly, this gun can literally just start shredding through any sort of armors, tier three and four upwards. Uh, as long as you combine. Uh, in fact, let me just show you the. Let's, let's, let's build the gun first, hey? So if I buy the parts, literally, it's going to cost 70k. I mean, I can't buy that foregrip. Oh. You might have one on the line around your stash. If not, just go stick with the RK1 or literally the RK4. Nice and easy. Boom. Buy. Yes. Purchase all. 70k. And most of this is dollars as well. So you can officially get your dollars up by going looting the safes in the customs area there's going to be a video coming for that soon make sure you click on the card up above in the future when that is available um but yeah this is literally the weapon you're going to want to run so let's assemble that all right you, what the ammo that you're going to want to be using for this weapon if you're using the laser match this is leg ammo or arms then you're going to want to be using the acp match fmj and if you have got it unlocked then whack yourself in the acp ap rounds this is the same price of a round than the M855A1 would be, uh, which I don't have unlocked at the minute, as at the point of this wipe. So if you've got it, use it. You'll get that for as you level up your traders. Basically, stick with the ACP match FMJ. Best all round budget ammo at $1. It shreds. Use it. All right. So what you're going to be doing next is the Benelli. The Benelli is super, super clean and easy to use. Super cheap to... Uh, to get as well all you need to do is go to jaeger you can buy this from tier 2 uh jaeger it's forty-one thousand rubles with this one you're going to edit preset you're going to want to whack on the seven round barrel adapter then you're going to want to put on the 12 gauge cylinder extension and whack on the gk02 to reduce that recoil a little bit more now literally you could run this as it is and make sure that you've literally just go in iron sight super clean again super easy to see down the site other than that, make sure you want to whack on a scope, cheap scope, all rounder, always the EKP, for the for extra economics. Add on a Cobra, it's literally one thousand rubles. And again, assembling this, it's twenty three thousand rubles. So for sixty thousand rubles, you're getting yourself a weapon, sixty five if you want to be pedantic. And assemble it. And with this, right now, if you've got flechettes, use flechettes. Now, flechettes, I'm pretty sure there's a task requirement to unlock them uh, when you get to Jaeger level 3. Um, I believe this is probably going to be the shotgun quest where you have to go into dorms. I can't remember what it's called off the top of my head. Um, we got to go into dorms. you got to kill 5 PMCs or uh, kill 12 PMCs with shotguns. I'm not too sure. Uh, I had a quick look. I couldn't really find how you actually unlock them right now. But... It's definitely not from Jaeger level 3. As you can see, I haven't got them. But flechettes are the best. Uh, but if you've got them, use them. It shreds any armor, any tier 5 armor. It even destroys. So use it. If not, use Magnum Buckshot. 8.5 mil Magnum Buckshot. Go for the legs. They will not live <laughs> to tell a tale. Uh, but that's the cheap other option. Second weapon. Now, this one has actually surprised me when I came across this one. Um, and this is the barter trade, sorry, wrong trader, uh, for the SKS. Now, you can get this from mechanic level two, I believe. Yeah, mechanic level two. I couldn't find it. Sorry, I went past it. So, you're going to get the GP coin, which is about 30,000 rubles. And then you've got the flat screwdriver. Sorry, not flat screw. Just the screwdriver, uh, which is, again, 10,000 rubles. So, I'll do just to show you. Purchase that right now. Uh, 
you'll probably have these GP coins from looting your safes, duffel bags, anything. Um, just check the price of the GP. Oh my god. Okay, let's just buy one from down here. Okay. Easy. And we're just going to buy this easy SKS. Let's go back. Oop. Whip out the SKS. And again, cheap, easy to mod. All you need to do, you can whack yourself on a foregrip straight away. Again, similar. If you're right at the beginning, you're going to be using the RK6, RK4, RK0. If you can and you've got the option to, the RK1 and obviously or any other foregrips that you've found out of raids, scaving or whatnot. So for this example, I'm literally just going to go with the RK4. All right. Uh, you can whack yourself on a scope. I personally, my personal favorites are the holographics. But again, you can if you wanted to use the Cobra. I wouldn't recommend it really on this one. Um, it is slightly further along the weapon. Your sight will be very small. Hence why I said to you, recommend if you can use yourself a holographic. It's nice and efficient. You don't even need to really put on an adapter on the end of it. If you do want to, just whack, up, whack on the thread adapter. And again, you can roll the DTK1. And also, I've been finding a lot of these around on customs just to get that extra compensation, get that vertical reel recoiled down. Using this gun, you're going to be using your 7.62 PS, any BP ammo that you find. Uh, and honestly, it's just a great better option than the RFB right now as the uh, M80s have all been moved up to tier 2 traders. Uh, it's tier, tier 2 traders, yeah. Um, other than that, guys, that's going to be that. What I will do is, uh, again, throughout this video, I will have dropped cards above each of the guns. So if you want to go and see a raid, uh, them videos will either be out as you speak well as i'm speaking for the time you're watching this video throughout the wipe or they will be uploaded in the future so make sure you subscribe and like help the video out with the algorithm and i also stream daily on twitch over art i also stream daily on twitch anywhere between 9 10 a.m right up and through till 3 4 p.m uh that's mondays to saturdays so hopefully i'll see you there thank you very much for watching out this video and i hope you all have a fantastic raids fantastic wipe and i'll see you all an interchange. Have a great one. Peace out. Adios.